At the present moment, Judge Torres has arrived at the conclusion that XRP does not fulfill the requirements for security and that standards do not apply to the situation. The implementation of the XRPL into a variety of different systems is becoming increasingly popular in a number of nations throughout the world, as we have observed an increase in demand for such. It is at the same time that this interest is developing that the remaining portion of the problem with the SEC is continuing to grind on without producing a resolution. I have created a video in which I discuss XRP and the advantages that it provides, and you may enjoy watching it by clicking on the link provided. In relation to the prospects for Ripple's future furthermore, as the lawsuit moves closer to completion, it is quite conceivable that other collaborations will be disclosed and acquisitions will take place. It is my opinion that Ripple will submit its initial public offering, IPO, sooner rather than later. The acquisition of Fortress by Ripple this week, for instance, is an essential part of Ripple's future expansion strategy. This acquisition also contributes to an increase in the value of the firm in advance of its initial public offering, which is anticipated to be revealed at some point in the near future. Due to the fact that we are not aware of the genuine nature of Ripple, let us talk about some issues that are of genuine importance. It is my opinion that the information presented here ought to make it clear whether or not it is advantageous to make long-term investments in Ripple, as well as the reasons why it is not safe to do so. There are a great number of cryptocurrencies in existence today, all of which have taken their inspiration from Bitcoin, the original cryptocurrency. Despite the fact that Bitcoin was the first cryptocurrency to be created by humans, it is indeed a complicated system that is dependent on a great number of distinct characteristics and components. In addition, the decentralized blockchain ledger of Bitcoin enables its millions of users to organize and save a history of their transactions. Additionally, it incorporates cryptographic hashing, which enables traders to protect their identities through a system of public and private keys. Miners are a helpful and motivated group that ensures everything runs smoothly. Bitcoin transactions are executed, particularly because there is a limited quantity available. These features have made it simple to store wealth, conduct safe transactions, and even engage in speculation. In contrast to Bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies, which prioritize network security, speed, and application in equal measure with the value of the coin, Ripple was never intended to be a coin or a traditional cryptocurrency. Ripple was built to be a decentralized digital asset. It is primarily for the benefit of the institutional clients that Ripple works with, such as Santander Bank and American Express, that Ripple has made the decision to abandon the concept of XRP as an investment asset and instead focus on strengthening the blockchain. For the purpose of achieving this one, there are no miners or mining at all on Ripple, rather, it is a centralized blockchain. The Ripple Foundation, which also made significant changes to every component of a conventional coin, established XRP. Power-powered transfers, which increase the transaction's reliability and speed. For the vast majority of other cryptocurrencies, mining is the primary source of revenue, and each cryptocurrency has its own algorithm to decide the amount of power that its miners possess. Mining is also the primary source of revenue for certain cryptocurrencies. Proof-of-work is just one of the many approaches that can be taken. Other methods include proof-of-stake and proof-of-importance. Examples of cryptocurrencies that use proof-of-work include Bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies. There are a number of problems that Ripple finds intolerable that have arisen as a consequence of the fact that the cryptocurrency itself serves as a form of payment for miners in the cryptocurrency ecosystem. In a solution that is designed for huge institutions, Ripple is of the opinion that there should not be a separate organization that is responsible for operating the network and has its own unique goals. This method has slowed down the development of other cryptocurrencies, which is something that Ripple cannot afford to do. Despite the fact that it has helped Ripple maintain its decentralized status, this technique has delayed the growth of other cryptocurrencies. Ripple deviates from the norm in other ways as well. Due to this absence of mining, miners receive cryptocurrency in addition to processing transactions. It is basically made in this manner. In this sense, Ripple's exclusion of miners inevitably throws a wrench into the works because Ripple is infinite and can be printed whenever needed. It is far more dependable for institutional tasks like money exchange and payment processing. It is easily destroyed after use. The 100 billion XRP in use today was previously produced by the Ripple Foundation, providing it with a steady, non-volatile nature ideal for its largest customers, but doing so also eliminates one of the most important components of a genuine cryptocurrency, its capacity to amass and hold value something that only a deflationary asset can do on a blockchain with centralization, though there is a wallet on Ripple. Accessing the blockchain, which is difficult for retail participants, is not intended since it brings unusual and dangerous factors into an otherwise sterile setting, unlike the blockchains of other cryptocurrencies.
The Ripple blockchain is closed, although XRP can be maintained and stored safely, and it protects users with encryption. The nodes it protects are not private users but rather trusted operators who have enrolled with the Ripple network. Thus, in the end, similar to the numerous inquiries concerning Bitcoin Cash, even the Ripple founders advise against utilizing their product as a medium of exchange for speculation because it isn't one. Ripple essentially combines the finest aspects of blockchain cryptocurrencies with fiat money, resembling a fintech platform more than anything else. Although Ripple isn't a true cryptocurrency according to conventional wisdom, it might represent the line separating assets from solutions, the two main things to come out of the cryptocurrency revolution, while assets can be putting faith in the deflationary properties of mining and a community that is decentralized. The solutions will put an end to speculation and will allow for the construction of platforms that are not traditionally considered to be cryptocurrencies, despite the fact that Ripple's price is increasing. There is no evidence to suggest that this is a prudent investment for the long run. Considering that nobody can accurately forecast the future, I will let you make the decision regarding these studies, in which you will first comprehend them and then make an investment. If you wish to acquire cryptocurrency, you should wait for the right time to do so rather than buying it quickly at a high price. This is because such a purchase would be more expensive. You seem to have the answer on your side, in my opinion. Despite the fact that I do not always have the time to post on my website, the majority of my trading advice is typically provided when I respond to requests for it. According to my point of view, it will be impossible for you to even buy XRP during the course of the next two years. It was not intended for XRP to be bought and traded on exchanges, rather, it was intended to serve as a bridge currency. If Ripple is successful in its case against the Securities and Exchange Commission, SEC, its price will begin to skyrocket. This is because Ripple will be the only currency that is not considered a security, and it will have legal certainty that will enable massive adoption by financial institutions in the United States. I am of the opinion that Ripple will not release any additional XRP from its escrow to retail exchanges in the near future. Even if they do relist XRP on their exchanges, which is something that I anticipate will take place, the sole reason why it will be made available to financial institutions is to meet their on-demand liquidity requirements. The one thing that concerns me is how repurchases from individual investors will be handled when we are no longer able to purchase them on exchanges. On the other hand, I believe that it is possible that it will be well past the $150 barrier before individual investors are shut out of the market. Because the ultimate goal of XRP is to be a stable coin that can be utilized on a variety of platforms, the XRP ledger serves as a bridge currency that can be used across all digital assets, including all digital systems. According to the calculations, the price of an XRP coin will range from about $35,000 to $50,000 after it is widely embraced as the bridge currency of the world. There is no way that we will be able to afford such exorbitantly high costs. At the time that we are excluded from the market without a big class action lawsuit a small number of people are aware of the challenges that are looming in the path of the golden age of mankind we are on the verge of experiencing wealth prosperity and abundance on a scale that has never been seen before because the best is yet to come make it a reality by vocalizing it make it visible it belongs to you as this wealth is brought into the hands of the people there will be a significant increase in the need for liquidity on a global scale between sovereign nations that use their own currencies and engage in commerce with one another due to this one simple fact the price of XRP will will skyrocket to an extremely high level XRP's decentralized ledger was developed with the intention of fostering interoperability across the several currencies that are utilized all over the world. This was the primary motivation behind its creation. XRP is going to prevail in the matter that it has been battling for, and it is nothing burger when it comes to this.